In the previous lesson, we took a look at creating organizational units with an Active Directory. And the purpose really was to organize it a little bit by putting groups and users and so forth within these organizational units. And later on, we can actually delegate some control to users to be able to manage those organizational units. However, there's going to come a point where you're probably going to want to delete an organizational unit. And you're going to see, say, well, usually just right click on something and choose delete, which you can do right now. And it says, are you sure you want to delete them? I hit yes. And then all of this, the sudden I get this little box that says, you do not have sufficient privileges to delete the sales. And you're going to say, well, wait a minute. I am the administrator account, which I am currently the administrator account. How could I not have the permissions for it? Well, here's what ends up happening. I'm going to go ahead and create a new organizational unit to show you. Let's go ahead and do new organizational unit. And when you're creating these, there's this little checkbox right there that says protect container from accidental deletion. Let's go ahead and create ourselves an organizational unit. I'm just going to call it test and hit OK. And there it is. And again, if I try to right click on it and choose delete, it's going to give me that same warning. So here's what we need to do in order for this to work. If you right click, we're going to change the view of our Active Directory here. I actually want to change it to this advanced features. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. You're going to notice that there's some additional organizational units that are created in, or actually now shown within this particular view. When we do this, we get a few more options. And so let me go ahead and re-click on test. And the options are going to show up when we click on properties. And we actually get a few extra tabs. One of these tabs is the one that I want to pay particular attention to, and that's the object tab. And if you take a look here, there's our protect object from accidental deletion. What I want to do is uncheck this, hit apply, hit OK. And if you want to go back to the old view, you can definitely do that. I'm going to go ahead and right click and go back to the old view. Let's just go to, actually, I'm going to have to do it up here on my domain. There we go. View, uncheck advanced features. And there we go. Now we can go ahead and see the way it was before. And I have already unchecked this accidental deletion uh, checkbox to prevent from it. So now if I right click and choose delete and hit yes, the test organizational unit has been deleted. So that's how you delete an organizational unit within Active Directory.